I'm Pat Gunn, and this is the next episode of my Let's Play of Fallout 4. And today, uh, we're going to go and visit Covenant. Because I just realized that because I'm traveling with McCready, he's actually pretty uh, compatible uh, with, with that quest. Various companions are kind of opinionated on what places you can go to, what places you can do, or at least they want you to, to do it a certain way. And so I typically will wait until I'm traveling with somebody who's uh, cool with the way that I would ordinarily resolve a quest. But here McCready is at least reasonably compatible with everything that we're going to do in Covenant, so let's do it. So Covenant, we swung by it before, but we didn't go inside in a past quest. It looks like it was a gated community maybe before the war, because at least it was something before the war. You can see that this structure here was already in place. No way to pick this. You here visiting Covenant, pal? If not, move along. You know, I'm people. I'd like to visit. Since you're a first timer, this we don't just let anyone inside. Right. Interesting idea. I probably shouldn't say nothing, but listen. We want to make sure. No, undesired. Mm -hmm. I'm new to the air. You know what? Don't worry. You want to take the test? Sure. Good. Take a seat. So he wants you to pass some psychological tests in order to visit the town. Which is a little bit weird. I think we would find this entirely bizarre in uh, the modern world. So let's begin. There ain't no wrong answers. You are approached by a frenzied scientist who you... What's your response? I wouldn't worry. If he did that, it'd cause a parabolic destabilization of the fission singularity. Uh, yeah. Next question. <laughs> While working as an intern in the clinic, a patient with a strange infection on his foot stumbles through the door. The infection is spreading it. Uh -huh. So this is an interesting... Uh, thing. I suppose screaming would probably be the most reasonable thing because it might manage to get the doctor or somebody nearby, but um, I wouldn't actually trust myself to amputate, and my character doesn't have any particular Just medical say the knowledge. First thing. Medicate the infected area as best I can. You have a medical background. You discover a young boy lost in a cave. He's hungry and frightened, but also appears... What do you do? I give the boy a hug. Very curious. Congratulations, eh? I don't play baseball. I play soccer. Are you certain about that? Never mind. Your grandmother invites you to tea, but you're surprised when she gives you a pistol and orders you to kill someone. What do you do? I... Hmm. Old Mr. Abernathy has locked himself in his quarters again. And you've been ordered to get. I grab. And that's all you do, right? Oh no. <laughs> you. Mm -hmm. I'd cut off the meat. Technology. A neighbor is in possession of a grognac. I'd trade him for one. Hmm. You decide it would be fun to. Play. I'd replace his blood pressure medicine with sugar pills. Tests over. No one's ever answered quite like you, <laughs> but hey. So later on you find that the, there's a little bit more sinisterness uh, to this. Okay, you can open the door. Don't make me carry that worthless crap. Welcome to Covenant. Head on in. Any yeah, shop is usually the first like stop. Rain. Wow. Okay, so we're inside, and Covenant appears to be a nice place in a reasonable state of repair. It's incredibly tiny, although I guess... The caravan came a few days back. Worked for old man Stockton. You saw him, right? I already told you. I don't recollect. We get a lot of traffic. This isn't Diamond City. A caravan of five comes through, you'd remember. Then they must not have come through. Say... Wouldn't you rather have a lemonade? My job here isn't drinking lemonade. I know for a fact they came here. 
Why the brush off? I want to help, mister, but I really don't recollect. Mark my words. I'll get to the bottom of this. Apparently From around this is here? a guy who was hired God, to go and not. find a missing caravan. Not enough of these hicks. What's it to you? Just doing my job. You know anything about Stockton's caravan? Oh, sure. I... You're as bad as the rest of them. Mm -hmm. I signed on with old man Stockton. Mm -hmm. The last mm -hmm. stop was here, so I've been trying right. got a proposal for you. And I intend to make good on my contract. If I help you, I want something up front. I'm offering an equal stake. And considering the work I've already put in... Uh -huh. Sounds fair. Here's all I got on the caravan. I don't got... Okay. Now, McCready likes it if, you, if you're always bargaining. But, uh... So here we can look around here. Uh, that. We can look around in the town. Or we get a quest marker to go visit the caravan and see what's going on. Let's just get this out of the way real quick. I guess he must have told us where the caravan is. Now you can see that the roads are in kind of a bad shape, and the centuries since maintenance has uh, has caused even some of the metal to begin to uh, bend down, which is interesting. And here we can see the destroyed caravan. The caravan was hit awfully close to Covenant, all right. And it was pretty well armed. And it must have been recent because there's no real signs of decay. Deezer's Lemonade. And there's Deezer's Lemonade. Okay. So, we have confirmation that the caravan is there. I think, yeah, that's one of our settlements. We've already been there a few times, and now it's being served by uh, my trade bots. So it's interesting to think, I, I guess these must have been houses before the war, surrounded by a nice big thick concrete wall. So it's a very gated community, like much more gated than, and out in the middle of nowhere than you would ordinarily think. But I guess there's kind of the open question as to whether before the war there were a lot more houses around that might have decayed without any treatment. Here we oh. have. Hi. Talia. Oh, I heard about you. You're the stranger. I'm the strangest I make of them all. The things for the store. Oh, I'm Talia. Hey. You're gonna like it here. Too bad the rest of the comic. I know. Feel free to use. Okay, so we can't. Talia. Oh, you're back. Isn't Covenant... Do you have time? If it'll help. I'm looking for a girl. Oh, I'm afraid I... Everyone around... Hiding? Why would you think... Okay, so... Tell you. Oh, you're back. Isn't Covenant... Mm. Oh, I'm so glad. So she doesn't really want to talk to us. I think that there are ways to, to get her to... Maybe, uh, talk about Let's stuff. Enjoy your stay. <clears throat> I hope Swanson didn't give you too hard, but welcome. Nice to meet a friend. You're in luck then. Come right. You here to shop? Let me see what you got. see what she has. I don't remember ever bartering anywhere. with her before. So, guess I could sh uh, sell this laser rifle and the guard outfit. Don't really need any of that stuff. What does she have? She has a destroyer's helmet. That's kind of interesting. Might actually pick that up since I'm. Hello, stranger. Okay. You got so anything that ails you? I'll any news out there, doctor? If you want rumors, then. Uh huh. Not now. Fine. Okay, so she doesn't really want to talk. Have a pleasant stay. It's in just time. a random settler. Penny, you here to shop? Do you have time for a few questions? For you? Hmm, certainly. 
Do you know any? You've been talking to. He's just. Mm -hmm. Definitely. I know. And Dan thinks he's the one. Right? He should be thank. Instead, he stomps. Sure. If the compound did do something, mm -hmm. you know, honey, I. Ah, so she slipped. And mentioned a compound. They're hiding something. I'm sure of it. Hey, you know Dan. What the compound is? This whole place has got me on edge. I hope you. I found out about a comp. Great. Now we just need to find. But he doesn't have the best memory. Mm -hmm. Do you have any other leads? No. If Calvin. Have any advice on what? They keep the barracks locked. We'll talk later. Okay, so we've made some progress. Well, hello. Hey there. Well, hello, stranger. The name's Jacob. Sure. You can use one of the beds in the... I appreciate... For people like you, you might want to stay clear of Mr. Dan. I've had some... Can I ask you some... Ask away. Do you know anything about a missing caravan? Is this about those stars? You ever hear? Why, that sounds interesting. This place almost looks pre-war. Hard work, shrewd. Uh huh. I have to so go. That is interesting. Like very f few of the other, uh, very few of the other settlements uh, really have a well-maintained feel to them. Busted again. Ted better get on this pronto. Another, robot Another new guy. Welcome. Hey there. From the menu. Why, Jesus, lemonade, of course. It's the most Okay, so he's heading out. Leaving us. And? And I certainly hope you'll have... The glass. It's amazingly refreshing, sir. Can anyone program normal robot bartenders anymore? It's quiet. What do we have... Dealing with depression, oh, 12 stages oh, of grief, and some self-help books. Quite the library here. Yeah, that is... This cell means business. Interesting. There's a cell that seems to be designed to keep people in. And there's a computer, which is pretty well locked down. Else might we find out where this place is? I'm doing a little bit of role-playing here and that having played the game before I actually know where it is, but at least in this instance. Okay, so there was mention of the slip of paper. Actually I've forgotten some of the details, so it's not It's actually surprisingly common how often people leave passwords on, uh... Got it. You're <laughs> full of surprises, aren't you? So we have an office key. But we do not have a password uh, to this office. I don't quite remember where it is. Might be on one of these sheets of pa uh, paper we picked up. Okay, so there's their their uh, report on uh, on the caravan that passed through. Oh, that's not from this. So we're going to 
keep looking. Mr. Fitzgerald. We don't tolerate violence or vulgarity. Steer clear of those, and we'll get along just fine. People that break our rules are asked to leave. Rarely happens, though. Okay, so it's theoretically possible I, I hate this thing to make it into that house, but you have to basically slip in uh, after somebody. Quick look around back here. Why does one tiny settlement need so much firepower? So there's some unclaimed junk here, uh, back here, that you can just take. Which is pretty handy. Ordinarily, in a settlement, if you take anything, then you'll make everybody uh, mad at you, and everybody will attack you. I hate this place. Stranger, you got anything that ails you? Well, the What's his scent? Why are they afraid of them? Lots of guns or whatever. Okay, so that's part of the story here. Where did Dan go? Hey, Dan. This whole place has got me on edge. I hope you found some. People here are real sensitive. You must be new around here. Real advanced. Everyone in the common. I've been here a long while. Mm -hmm. So... Ask three different people. Most people will. Sister disappeared. But I've never met a sister. But there's no denying. We'll talk later. Okay, so we've gotten a lot of leads. But we have not yet managed to get into this computer. But I think if we close the door. That's some serious security. Maybe there's another way around it. We should be able to hack our way in. Got it. And here you get the feeling that the town is a lot more organized than you might think. It's not just a bunch of random people. It's people who, who have worked together. And now we have our answer. Hey, Dan. You find out anything about the caravan? They took the survive and we're in business. I'll meet you there. Okay, so we know where th this place is and we know how to uh how to get there. But rather we know where this place is and we've talked with Honest Dan about making a trip out there. So one thing I'm going to try to do, which I don't know if I've ever succeeded at before, but is to see if there's any way to make your way out of the town without talking no nope, not quite okay he's just perched right at the door because he wants to talk to you I wonder if hey just oh well that's amusing I managed to glitch out his conversational routines so off we go the hint that we got was that there's a fisherman located um, at a water intake uh, set of pipes. And it turns out that that is right across from the town. So we'll do a quick swim across the river. And here Go is our find fisherman. your own fishing spot. Clear out. Hi. People are no, mucking around the shore at all hours. Scaring my fish. Okay. 
So this is the spot. We are going to go in. Now if you ask me, this is kind of a weird place to have the entrance to a large underground facility. Hey, Dan. Some people up ahead. I'll follow your lead. Okay, so we're warned that there's some people waiting for us. And they have a pretty smart arrangement. There's a lot of light, so it's hard to see. Outsiders Stop. aren't allowed. Why are you here? I just want answers. That's unfortunate. Okay, it turns out. Safe scum your way through uh, through this. Damn it! Where'd you go? Full tech lab coats are pretty nice in that they are one of the few solid intelligence enhancing bits Don't of gear. Back. But unfortunately, like a whole lot of other gear in the game, you can wear other uh, other gear over it. So it takes up precious slots that you are gonna Sign of the caravan. be able to better use for other be things. Someplace. What the hell are they doing here? kind of tempting, because there are some nice things that you can do with Chemist. Um, although, I think Medic is actually going to be a little bit more useful for us. They've repurposed some old world sewers. I don't like the sight Chained of on the other Chained side. on the other side. Just in general, in Fallout, the game doesn't want to make you backtrack through long sections. What's that? I'm feeling awesome. eyes on my back. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. So it likes to have chain doors. so that you can make your way all the way through the dungeon. And generally, the dungeons have kind of a circular feel. And then when you hit the other end... The intruder must be eliminated. Some sort of bridge. Must be another way around. And when you hit the other end, you can just open up the door and you're ready to uh, hop through. Okay, so... Carefully work our way through here. This is, it looks like another interrogation center. Gather people up, torture them, and all for the safe test. Whoever this belongs to needs to find themselves a new hobby. Down. Shell's empty. Damn it. Serious about torture if they're using a uh, baseball bat. Oop, there is a compound guard. I guess 
guarding the uh, the compounds. It's a pretty important thing to do in a chemistry lab, but important out here too. Gathered, so I'm going to stop gathering it from new people. Okay, here we go. This is a well lit area with several exits. Hey! She's most likely a synth. Stockton's daughter is a synth? Why else do you think we attacked her caravan? After testing, we have well over a 70% confidence level of our initial. Sure. I'd have to perform an autopsy. There's nothing you can say. Everything we've done has been to... Covenant is meant, but most importantly, I will make you a deal. I've had my fill of crazy on this contract. No deal. Fortunate for me, I wasn't talking to you. You side with this nut job, and we're going to have a serious, deadly problem. Are you threatening? I have myself a code. That's not always good on my wallet, but it helps me sleep at night. I took this contract, and I will honor it, even if I have to kill you to do it. Don't kill the girl. Spare her. Come on, Doc. Think what you're up against. Impossible. The odds are too great she's an Institute infiltrator. Even if she is an unfortunate victim in this war. Covenant's a refuge? Over the years, mm -hmm. Covenant is primarily about it if you destroy. That's a deal I won't. You should have offered more, lady. Oh well. Then you'll just have to kill. Actually, I, I'm not sure if you need to kill her. She hasn't been hostile yet. 
some nice combat armor. Oh, and she's just going to go back and work on equipment and stuff. And they're worried about the colony not working particularly well. Something worth a few caps in here. Yep, so we'll just head up and say hello. Uh, wherever she is. Oh, maybe she left. Hey, Dan. So Stockton gets his daughter and we get paid. Not a bad day. I want my reward. Understood. Here's your cut of the reward. I did more than half. There's some truth to that. Be safe, Dan. Same to you. Okay, so... McCready might, might not have liked that we refused that deal, but he did like that we, uh, we bartered a lot with Honest Dan. Dr. Chambers, I will not beg for my life. That's fine. We don't need to take it. I think in past Let's Plays I didn't realize that you could just ignore Dr. Chambers. Come on, just leave it. And uh, head on out. But apparently you can do that. And she, she is just left alone in the belly of a now empty hideout. So my guess is that after the end of the day, she'll head back and she'll think, you know, this wasn't a particularly good day. interesting to compare this organization, which you cannot join, to that of the railroad, which you can. In that they both are opposed to the Institute, but they're taking different, uh, different approaches to how, uh, how scared they should be of synths in general. And there's an information asymmetry in that some railroad members are synths. Coming back here. The turrets are fine. You ruined everything. Opening fire. What? He's not particularly thrilled. Huh? And McCready is happy to go inside. surprisingly uh, well-armed and capable. But I guess you would can't expect that from a settlement that has uh, that has giant turrets uh, outside of it. Take 
everybody's stuff for now. And we're inside. And I don't believe that there's anybody left to be upset with us. And the workshop is now ours. So it's an unfortunate end. So now there are cats, and there's Deezer. Hey, Deezer. Take some. Enjoy! So, these are. Uh, he's still handing out lemonade. Now that we have the key, we can enter this area and find that there's all sorts of stuff under beds. There's actually some very nice beds, too. And that's where Jacob's password is. I thought that there was another copy of it in a trash can somewhere, but apparently not. So this has been the story of Covenant, and the safe test, and all of that other fun stuff. We're going to leave it empty now. Eventually we'll probably move some people to it, but there's some trickiness in that so much of... Because Covenant was not something that we ever established an alliance with, so much of it is marked as owned. And that means that we need to be extremely careful when visiting it that we don't end up that we don't end up uh, immediately angering all of our uh, settlers so basically you need to go and pick up everything that you can possibly pick up and that's a bit of a chore so we have a lab coat and a Baltic lab coat probably between games I'm going to triple check that you cannot um, wear things over either of those because it would be nice to get the intelligence boost to keep pushing our character's intelligence up into crazy levels but I don't think it's actually uh, possible So plasma uh, grenades are, are really quite nice. The problem is that by the time you really need them, you're not gonna, you never really get much of a supply of them. And so you, you always have to use them sparingly. They're not quite too awesome to use, but they're pretty far up there. And so before we sign off for the day, we're going to also just take a quick peek over here, because a lot of excitement tends to come from over here. But nope, nothing. Good. So, uh, this has been a uh, Let's Play of Fallout 4, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye.